Today I'm going to attempt to drive my boyfriend's manual R33 Skyline for the very first time. It's manual and I haven't driven a manual in like six years probably. He has never let me drive his car but for the sake of this video he's going to let me in the driver's seat and I'm going to vlog me driving his car for the very first time. If you're new here don't forget to subscribe because I post videos weekly. Let's go and see this car. He's going to drive that out of the garage because there's no way he's going to trust me to do that. So I have a couple interview questions for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do you feel about me driving your car today? Not worried about the car, just more the clutch. Okay, so you're not actually worried about the car? No. Should be so right. you have faith in my driving skills? Yeah, but you've driven a couple of my other cars, so... Yeah, I've driven a couple of his other cars, but they haven't been loud or this expensive. No. And what about my manual skills? Because I drive an auto. Yeah, it might just get a bit getting used to. The clutch is quite heavy, so you might struggle with that. But yeah, the basics down pat, so. Okay. It's mainly the clutch that I you think, have issues with. I think you have a bit more trust than, in me than I do in myself. Why? Because I'm a bit nervous. You gotta back yourself. <laughs> and so, where am I allowed to drive it to? Up the road down there. All the way on the road? Oh, yeah. I think I'll start with the driveway first, and then we'll drive it down the road. Mm. So you can get second gear or something. So give me a few details for the watchers and the audience here today. Why is it so expensive for what it is and what's so special about this car? It's just my favourite looking skyline. Mm -hmm. I've had it since I was about 18 with my mate. Mm -hmm. Collectively. Mm -hmm. I just brought it back. Any cool features? It has a cool sunroof, yeah, which is cool my personal sunroof. favourite. It's factory turbo, factory manual. Mm -hmm. It's a few turbo upgrades and stuff, so it goes alright. Okay, we're gonna let it charge for a little bit because the battery is a little bit pooped. Not pooped, it's just been flat, it's been sitting for a couple yeah, months. Yeah, well, because yeah, the, the car's been sitting for a few months, so the battery's not very good. So we're just gonna charge it first because just in case I stall, it won't be able to start again. So we'll be right back. So you're going to sit in the passenger seat and film me. Okay. <laughs> well, low to the ground. Alright, I'm going to take my shoes off. Do you think? Mm -hmm. So we're going to start by just going up the driveway for now. How do you move your seat? There's a little lever down the bottom. I don't feel any lever. Oh wait, there. Yeah, it's in side. the front. I feel like I'm too far back. It's as far as the seat goes, isn't it? I know. There you go. So, any advice on the clutch? It's heavy. Try to press it in now. Do I have to be able to press it all the way in? All the way in. Oh my gosh, that's so... Yeah, it's a heavy duty clutch, so... And make sure you're all the way in. Yeah. And then... This is a leg workout. I oh, know, it's harder than traffic. Like, how are you supposed to sit in traffic like this? Oh, you put it in neutral, so you put something on the clutch. Okay. Ah! First. Okay, right. ready? Pick out the brake. See if you roll. Okay, give it a bit of gas. A little bit less. Yeah, off the clutch now. Huh? Oh, no. <laughs> gas, gas. <laughs> nice, you got it this time. Yeah, I almost stole. Oh, really? It feels really like lurchy, like touchy. Yeah. The accelerator. Okay, where are we going to turn it around? You might just have to turn it around here. Gas, 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 gas. You need gas. <laughs> I'm trying to turn it around. Yeah, give it a bit of gas. Or do you want to turn it around? No, you can do it. Gas. Get off the brake. Yeah, yeah. Now slowly clutch. Don't ride the clutch, though. What does that mean? Like, don't just like sit there with the clutch slightly out. Because it's like riding the clutch. You're like burning it. But it's easy to do it. Yeah, I know, but it's not, it's not good for the car. Gas. Stole it. Ah. Oh. Alright, turn it, turn it back on. Ah, this is so... Oh, well, it's flat, so... After that experience driving up the driveway, would you let me drive on the road? Yeah, probably. Yeah. What? Well, not on the main road, but like, to get like second gear and third gear, maybe? I just don't like driving manuals. Because mm. you have to focus on starting and on stopping. Well, like, I was just about to just put my foot on the gas. 
Yeah, once you start. I mean, on the brake. When, when you get the hangar manual, it's like driving an auto. Like everything, it's just like everything comes to sense. It's second nature. Yeah. Uh, we will I don't be... even get to change gear. No. Quick intermission, we're just gonna jump start it and then we'll be back. Okay, so for the next part of this vlog, we're gonna do a little game where you're gonna point to parts of the car. Yep. I'm gonna have to try and guess what it is. We'll start easy, okay? What's this? You said start easy. That is probably the easiest thing. Turbo. That is the turbo. But your final guess for this part is turbo. No, that's not the turbo. Show it, because the turbo looks like a snail. Any hints? This is supposed to be easy, like start with the battery or something. The battery is not in this part of the engine bay. Is it not? It's it's in, that is the battery. No, it's a fuse box. That is probably oh, the no. easiest thing I can point out. No, the easiest thing that you could point out is the... Okay, we'll, go, we'll start there. What's this? The oil. That's the oil. <laughs> that's the oil that you put in there. No, that's incorrect. <laughs> What's this? I don't think I can name anything. You brought one of these before. A bonnet thing. The bumper. Yes. The bumper. What do we call that? Any hints? Air goes through it. Filter. No. Radiator. No. Am I close? The word you were looking for. Don't say the intercooler. <laughs> yes. Okay, now we'll go back to this one. Seeming you've already got it. You've already said what it is. What does it look like it does? Filter. Yeah. What is this right here? The engine. No. That is the engine technically, <laughs> yes. It is the first letter? C. Coolant. No, coolant, coolant. goes into that radiator. Oh. That is a coil pack. Right, what's that silver shiny thing down in there? Is that the turbo? That is the turbo indeed. It doesn't look like a snail though. This is called the oil stick. Yep. It's a dipstick. Okay, we'll start off easy with that. That would be the gear stick. The handbrake. What about these? Those are called... Do they have a name? Yep. Gauges. Yes. That is the gauges. What is, does this button do? That is the... Is it something to do with speed? No. Is it something to do with function? Yeah. I don't think you'll get that one. It lifts the antenna up and down. Okay, I was never going to get that one. What is this? That's the turbo. Does it turn it on and off or does it? It releases more turbo. What do you mean releases more turbo? It releases more so you can go faster. How does it is release? It, is turbo in the name? No. Oh. NOS. No. So that's one setting and that's the other setting. What would that be? It's on and off. No, it's not on and off. Is it more or less? Yes. It's releasing something. You're kind of on the right track. There's two settings. High or low? Yes. And <laughs> high or low what? High or low turbo. Yes. Like boost. Yes. <laughs> High and what is it? It's, an, it's like a NOS. No, it's, it's a. But what is this whole s contraption? Boost gauge. No. Boost. Boost antenna. What do you do to a light? Boost switch. Yes. <laughs> so what is it? It's a boost switch. Yes. High and low boost switch. But it's like. And it looks like NOS. Kind of. In Fast and Furious. They have those. And that's it. Yeah. I think I need to probably... I don't think you got one right. I think I only got the answers when you gave me a hint. Yeah. But you didn't even get oil filter. <laughs> or the radio. What about cam belt? I got cam belt. Okay, I didn't point at the cam belt there. It was a... Uh... But I guessed it by myself. Yeah, but it wasn't the right answer. <laughs> and I got guessed it can handbrake. Woo! Yep. Is it louder? Touch all the, all the way in in a second. Go, 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 go. Yeah, now third. Touch in. Easy. Oh, that was smooth. Yeah, that's good. Go down, slow down. And then second. Touch in. Oh, Ooh, bit fast, but it's still right. I'm nervous. Now indicate. Good indicate. Yeah. Now stop. stop. Fully stop and touch all the way in. Oh. Holy. <laughs> right, now first. <laughs> Slowly oh, up the... it's like a workout. Yeah, that's right. You got that? Ready? And gas, you need gas too. Yeah, go. Oh, Ooh. it's good. That's not too bad. Yeah, damn. Oh. 
That's yeah. a bit nerve wracking. It was good. Second to third was really smooth. Yeah, it was good. Now hold the brake and press the gas. Wait, hold the brake yeah. and the gas? Yeah, go both at the same time. Why? Uh, just do it. And gas, now gas, 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 gas. No, oh, no, never mind. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, breaking my car. Let's do a little recap. How did you find that experience? It was fun. It was fun. Changed gear nicely. I got up to third. Yeah. And what do I need to work on? Your overall everything manual driving experience <laughs> everything yeah. not everything but like you're still panicking when you're changing gear yeah and you forgot to indicate so like you need to drive around a lot first before i go into before you go road. into traffic because then that traffic will make you panic more yeah and is this car legal yes it's legal for four more days for four more days okay yeah. and do you have any questions for me how did you find driving the car was it easy easier than you thought it was fine but the clutch was just really yeah. really really tough yeah or heavy as mm. you call it no i don't think i have any more questions you quite surprised me today <laughs> okay well that's gonna be the end of this video if you like this video don't forget to press like and subscribe and comment your thoughts on how i did next it could be sophia tries a skid in the r33 skyline yeah i could do that next so mm, let me know comment next, below yeah. don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye bye